Hi guys, a short video about the Linux Xenmod kernel and Arch Linux. At this point of recording, 2024, beginning of February, the Xenmod kernel is back up and running and we don't see any errors when we have it. Now, if you type kernels, one of our aliases, you see that I have two kernels installed, the Arch one, which is now working at this point in time. And there is also the Xenmod that's working but not really applied right it's not used now in this case i've chosen let's do this i've chosen in well first of all i've built a new iso so we'll probably release a new iso articling xs zenmel since it's working again calamars is not uh, stopping anymore because the combination of the kernel and the make init cpo application from arch is good right no errors anymore now the topic of the video is if you choose to test out the Arclix, um well the xenmod kernel <laughs> that's not from Arclix, right the linux xenmod kernel if you try to uh, install it and use it you might end up the same way as i do up here it says not xenmod kernel it says the default kernel how do i get to go from this regular kernel to the xenmod kernel if you have system d boot chosen in calamars probably you'll find a video somewhere about it but it's never it did not come out of the search so i'm gonna make one more default you have to well actually do this easier because it's set default it's not default it's set default so you don't need to remember things the only thing you need to remember is boot ctl control your boot in system d boot not in grub set default and then tap tap that's it that's your kernels one of them is the one you need and it's not going to be auto reboot or firmware setup it's going to be the xen mod so the first one 355 tap and then you at the very end and you take a look at this one six and the other one is seven so i need to type six tap done that's it right and then we reboot reboot is longer to type than pseudo reboot sr and then everything is fixed. We're back, well, well, we'll try now the Xenmod kernel. So now default is the second line, which is what I want. I want to test out the Xenmod kernel. And to my left, we're installing it on real metal, on an NVIDIA machine. If voila, we're back in business. We can back in beginning of February, you can try out the Xenmod kernel if you like to do so. All right. So remember, if you're on boot CTL, so if you're sorry, if you're system D boot, this is the way how to know it. If you're C there system D boot, then this is gonna be the align. Set default and then you choose the line. Alright, cheers.